final chapter of human history inaugurated by the advent of the Messenger of God Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was destined to be dominated by two great civilizations that which emerged in the lands of Islam and that of Christian Europe later to be called the West Did you know that non-Muslim communities living under Muslim empires of the past were allowed to follow their own religion, customs and laws, including drinking wine and eating pork? Did you know that the philosophical writings of Muslim scholar Ibn Rushd were translated into Latin and spread through Europe in the 12th and 13th centuries, leading to a rationalist movement? Did you know that the Caliph Harun Rashid ruled over an empire that was almost twice the size of the Roman Empire at its height? These are just small glimpses of our proud and rich heritage which spanned over a thousand years in which the Islamic civilization dominated and led the world in learning, art and culture. In response to a pressing need and a major educational gap, we have developed a history course focusing on the Islamic and Western world civilizations. The aim is to empower Muslims with the knowledge of where we have come from, the journey and where we are now. This knowledge will enable us, God willing, to embrace our heritage, understand our situation, and inform our responses to the challenges facing our Rama. The true reality of events can only be fully known when examined through the lens of revelation and the Quranic worldview. The syllabus has been carefully crafted to facilitate students to gain an understanding of the history of the Islamic and Western civilizations and how they interrelate from the early Middle Ages up to the end of the 20th century. The period under study is segmented into four major phases providing a broad sweep of the major historical events. The High Caliphate period, in which most of the Muslim world is united under one Caliph who commands the greatest empire in the world. The middle period of Islamic Sultanates, Emirates and Khanates, in which myriad polities and dynasties come and go but which form the Muslim Commonwealth, united by a common language, religion and culture. The gunpowder period, dominated by the emergence of three great empires in the Muslim world, the Ottoman, Magal and Safavid, which continue Muslim global preeminence, while Western Europe is undergoing its renaissance, reformation and age of discovery. The final period of the European age witnesses the gradual rise of the European colonial empires which come to dominate most of the world by the end of the 19th century following the momentous and self-destructive power struggles between these colonial powers in the 20th century. The two world wars, the mantle of Western civilization is taken on by the new world superpower, the United States of America, which proceeds to fashion a new world order. If we do not know where we came from, we do not know who we are. It is hoped that this course will help connect us to our past. During this course, we unapologetically examine the received history that we find in many Western textbooks and challenge many Eurocentric biases and distortions that have inevitably crept in, especially since the time of colonial domination. This unique course has a lofty ambition to rename, reclaim and retell our history. Then it is up to the intelligent student to decide which version corresponds closer to reality.